Okay, so I went um I went over the mask with some loose powder again. So now I'm gonna go ahead and just start sponging the color right on. Okay, so I tore away a lot of the excess um, latex that I had applied earlier. Like I said, and here it goes, some more. Um, this is my first time doing this with you right now, so I wasn't sure how exactly to do this. Now even here at my eyebrows, like, it's not that cute, but you know what? I like it. I like this rough edge. I think I'm going to keep it like that. I could go over it and, um, you know, trace it, which you can easily. You can get um, a small bristled brush and just um, get black and, you know, go along the edge. But I really like it like this. So now what I'm doing is, from my Coastal Sense palette, um, I'm taking just different shades of green and going over the mask in different areas. So I had started over here doing some light spots and dark spots, um, really doing some light right underneath the eye and bringing it up, um, using like lime greens and yellows. Um, so I'm going to just go ahead and continue to do that. And then, um for maybe this outer edge I'm going to just dust it with black and um, the darkest color and the lightest color will sort of make the scales a little bit more apparent so I'm just taking different shades of green and going over it Okay, so I'm done with my nose, kind of flatten it out a little bit, a little more reptile-like. Now I'm going to do the lips. So, here we go. I'm going to go ahead and line my lips with a red lip liner. Here we go. Now I'm going to fill them in with a lipstick. Now with a lip brush, I'm just gonna blend it in.
Okay. So now what I'm going to do, I'm going to extend this point right here and bring it out. And do it again on the other side. Okay, so this is it. This is the look.